Welcome to AmeenAcademy.com. In linear algebra, let us discuss about row echelon form of matrices. What is echelon form? In linear algebra, a matrix is in equivalent form if it has the shape resulting from a Gaussian elimination. That means after Gaussian elimination of the matrices, we will get equivalent form. A matrix being in row equivalent form means that Gaussian elimination has operated on the rows. And the column equivalent form means that Gaussian elimination has operated on the columns. In other words, a matrix is in column equivalent form if its transpose is in row equivalent form vice versa. Therefore, only row equivalent forms are considered in the remainder of this articles. That means, if you understand the row equivalent form, automatically we can understand that uh, column equivalent form by transposing it. The similar properties of column equivalent form are easily deduced by transposing all the matrices. Especially a matrix is in row equivalent form if all rows consist of only zeros are at the bottom. The leading entry that is the leftmost non-zero entry of every non-zero row is to the right the leading entries of every row above. Now further details we can tell about or echelon form by using steps. All zero rows are at the bottom of the matrix. The leading entry of each non-zero row after the first occurs to the right of the leading entry of the previous row. The leading entry is in a non-zero row is 1. All entries in the column above, the above and below a leading one are zeros. Another common definition of equivalent form only requires zeros below the leading ones, while the above definition also requires them above the leading ones. Look at this, this is an example for equivalent form matrix. Like here, look at this, these are zeros and here zeros. Here is a pivot. We consider this is a pivot. Now we will do an example to understand the equivalent form. Reduce the following matrix in equivalent form by using row reduce method. Here look at this. A matrix is augmented matrix. Given. Look here. Now we will start to reduce row equivalent form. First replace R2. The replace R2 by minus 2 r1 plus r3 because look at this first row it is 1 here the second row this is 2 if you multiply with minus 2 the first row then minus 2 plus 2 is 0 that means this this first the second row first element becomes 0 like second and replace r3 by minus 3 r1 plus r3 that also here also it becomes zeros look at this replace replace R2 that is row 2 by minus 2 R1 plus R2 and replace R3 by minus 3 R1 plus R3. Now let us do this operation. First we we'll write the given matrix one more time. That is 1, 2, minus 3, 0 and 2, 4, minus 2, minus 2 and 2, third is 3, 6, minus 4 and 3. First we will do the second row operation that is minus 2 R1 plus R2. Minus 2 R1 plus R2 and third row operation is minus 3 R1 plus R3. Look at this here. First 
first row as it is because we are not operating first row 1 2 minus 3 0 here second row is 2 or 1 2 into 1 is 2 here operating is minus 2 or 1 here minus 2 into 1 is minus 2 and plus 2 is 0 that is here the second minus 2 into 2 is minus 4 plus 4 is 0 third minus 3 into minus 2 is 6 6 minus 2 is 4 and 2 into minus 2 into 0 is 0 and then plus 2 is 2 third row operation is minus 3 r1 into r3 3 into r1 is minus 3 plus 3 is 0 your next is minus 3 into 2 is 6 minus 6 and plus 6 is 0 and here next is Uh, minus uh, 3 r1 minus 3 is minus plus uh, 9 here minus 3 r1 minus 3 r1 is 9 plus r3 is here with minus 4 here and 3 Here, next, we we'll write one more. So here, minus uh, 0, 0, 4 and 2, 0, 0, 5 here now. This is a plus 5 and 3. Next, then also, also a3 consider a23 a23 that is uh, element in second row third column that is equal to 4 4 as a pivot as a pivot that means this 4 as a pivot we consider then we write replace replace uh, R3 by minus 5 R2 plus 4 R3. Look at here. R3 minus 4 R. That is minus 4 minus 5 into 4 is minus 20. Here 4 into 5 is 20 adding 0. Like here also 0 comes. Therefore we have to write that above as 1, 2, minus 3, 0 and 0, 0, 4, 2 and 0, 0, 5, 3. Now row operation in third row is minus 5 of 2 plus 4 of 3. That means after third row operation we have first and second row as it is 1, 2, minus 3, 0, 0, 0, 4, 2. Third operation is minus 5 R2 plus 4 R3 is here also 0, 0. Here 0. This is 2 that is minus 5 into 2 is minus 10 and 4 into 3 is 12 that is 2 here which is row equivalent form it is row equivalent form here so far we have done the explanation of what is equivalent form matrix and also have done an example to understand the concept that is uh, to reduce the row equivalent form of the given matrix. The matrix A is given. We did some row operations to get the row equivalent form which is here. We have done. Please subscribe our YouTube channel.